Hey guys, in this tutorial I want to show you how you can add some instructions to your Instagram filter. For example, tap to change or tap and hold the record button to start. Instructions are really important because also Instagram wants you to use them. So let's start. Hey again, so let's add an instruction to your Instagram filter here in this bug AR studio. This is pretty simple. You just have to go to your scene bundle and then here you have to click on device. Then you just go to the right hand side and you can find the instruction panel here at the device properties. And here you will see on opening and next choose an instruction. Just open this drop down menu and you will find the most common instruction right here. For example, tap to change, tap to start or tap and hold record to start. But there are many more instructions you can add to your Instagram filter. For this just click on see all instructions. Then this menu will pop up and here you can search for many instructions you want to add and they are also here sorted by body tracking, hand tracking, face tracking, target tracking and plane tracking. For example, when you click on face tracking, you can find a lot of instructions which are linked to the face. For example, open mouth to start. But for this example here, I will add the most common instruction. For this, I will search for tab to change and we'll add a tab to change instruction to this filter. So, when you click on insert, SpaGR will automatically create some patches for you. The first patch is the runtime patch, then a last 10 patch, and also this yellow device patch with the instruction token in it. And yeah, what is this patch doing? This just says that this instruction will stay for five seconds after the user opened the filter. You can test this, so just restart the filter and you will see the tab to change instruction here and after five seconds it disappears. Here in the preview the instruction is down there, but of course when you test it on your device it will be in the middle of the screen. The instruction is always in the language the user has set the phone in, so when the um, yeah, phone is set to German um, the instruction will also be in German. So for the tab to change example it would be nice when the tab to change instruction stays as long as the user taps the screen. So when the user taps the first time the screen the tab to change instruction will disappear. So we can do this pretty simple. For this we just go to our patch editor and here we have to add three patches. The first thing will be of course a screen tab patch the next one will be a switch patch and the last one will be a not patch. So then we just have to set the patches up. So the guest to state output of the screen tab patch goes into the turn, in, turn on input of the switch and the output of the switch goes to the not patch and the not patch goes to the enabled input of the device. Now you can see the instruction is packed and it will stay um, as long as we tap the first time on the screen. So I will go here and set to simulate touch and when I now tap on the screen the instruction is gone. Um, the instruction will not be shown in the recorded video so it is no problem when the instruction stay also stays when the user records the video because in the final story it will not show up. So yeah you can now play around here with all the patches and all the um, yeah, instructions and yeah instructions are really um, important for Instagram filters because yeah, the user knows what to do in the filters and also when you do some custom instructions this means when you do um, your own overlays um, Instagram may not um, yeah, accept the filter. So always use these standard instructions here. I hope I could help you with this video. If yes, give it a thumbs up and if you're new to this channel it would be nice when you subscribe to it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye!